Hey, what up everyone? I'm Cinny Cool, and this is Gems of War. And today I have two teams for you, a high level and a low level for the tower event, Invasions. And it was one of the easiest ever. I, I literally got to, to four towers in like seven minutes. Like, that's how easy it was. So, two teams for you, high level, low level. The first one here is mostly to just like hit all enemies and get to the end like really quickly but it still works with four towers it does not use the tower killer but it does use the new troop captain salt claw the new legendary that we got this week so pretty cool he's a rogue and that works out for this event because there's a rogue restriction all right so night spider is going to be your best friend for this event um captain mccall also a very good troop for this event um with the rogue restriction captain mccall starts all rogues with 50 percent mana so consider using him for this event. Uh, Night Spider, very good loopy troop that does uh, blue and purple for this event. A lot of rogues are blue or purple. And it, it can loop. It can just loop and loop and loop because the whole team is rogues. It does its gem spawn based off of rogues. So another troop you should heavily consider would be the Night Spider. Um, then we have Captain Sawclaw, who does damage to like all enemies, basically. It's like splash damage, but it hits like all enemies pretty much almost all the time and um he does damage based off how many blue are on the board and night spider's putting a bunch of blue on the board so pretty cool and then i just put Dawnbringer on there to like clean up and it also um will take extra blue it's got yellow on it to you know it's it, for um you know different colors and stuff like that plus the whole team's like almost the whole team's red or or like blue so really good team here and um it like literally i i recorded from jump to end and then i looked at my recording and it was seven minutes and something from from like start and i was f messing around in the shop and everything at the beginning you know i wasn't like trying to go super fast you know i was done in seven minutes and something like got to the four towers and that's probably all you need to do today is like get to the four towers and then you can finish it up saturday and sunday but yeah done in like seven minutes today pretty easy um so captain salt claw pretty good new troop if you, if you can put a bunch of blue on the board um i've been using um jar of eyes with them i was using them yesterday in the class event because i think it was the same kind of restriction yesterday for for that um so that makes this even easier because you already went through this yesterday if you did the corsair class event um the only difference here is the um the uh you get a new weapon which is pretty good. It's one of those explodey, give a positive status effect summony troops. And, um, you know, you got the tower killer that can one-shot towers if you want to use it. Which I don't know what you would, like, replace on this team to, to do that. Maybe if you didn't need to use your hero, you could put uh, Red Charlotte on there instead of your hero. And you could one-shot some towers with it. Um, yeah, the, I, I only ran into this one battle right here that you're seeing right now. And... He is the the tower submerged. So if I could get up that uh, that um Captain McCall, I'd hit him really hard. But you can just loop until you get something up and then and then get him. And the Captain Salt Claw, if they have um barrier, he'll, he'll skip right by that because he hits multiple times, and he hits pretty hard. I haven't really got to like figure out exactly how much he's hitting for because he's pretty much one shotting everything. It seems like, um, but he's a pretty good new troop. I wouldn't say he's like awesome like um Chalcedony or flaming oni or anything like that but he does hit all enemies he he wipes them out he's a rogue he goes with night spider pretty good so consider captain salt claw consider captain mccall consider night spider and then whatever you want to do for that last slot most people are going to use their hero but um yeah red charlotte or something would be fine as well all right, this one, we're using the Red Charlotte, so two of them. This is the low-level team, so nothing above Epic. And um, all you got to do for Red Charlotte is make yourself a little bit of gold, and then she'll get all of her mana back. I think it's something like 30 gold. That's all you need. 25 to 30 gold, you'll cast her, and she'll get all of her mana right back. And you can just cast her, cast her, cast her, cast her. So pretty good as well. I was um, not 100% on the weapon, I went with Bronze Lock Pistol because I know it is used in like gold gold teams. I think it has a perk on it that gives it gold. It does destroy uh, gems uh, boosted by gold collected. And the um, Egg Thief is going to make us a little bit of gold. Um, 
But yeah, you could maybe tweak this team slightly and make it slightly better. But it not 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 too crazy because it gets going pretty quickly. Like you could you could make it jump off a little bit faster maybe with something else. Maybe the weapon I'm I'm thinking. Maybe the new weapon has some sort of gold on it. Um, maybe you know of a weapon that gives gold like right away. But um, right now it shows me using Titan class for the Brown Storm and stuff and the 50% start. But um, I switched to uh, Thief class eventually because Thief class will give you some gold. It's got Greedy on it and then it has a um, talent that also gives gold. So like five gold a turn and then another talent that gives gold. And then if you cast the Egg Thief, then there's all your gold you need to, to get all your mana back with Red Charlotte. So I was using the other team, <clears throat> the high level team. For most of the time just to see if how fast like yeah just to uh, get to four towers and um so i didn't get to use this team as much i think if i had kept going with this team i probably would have switched switched um something out like maybe the second red charlotte or the weapon is what i'm thinking because you see me here switching to thief class like you can't always come up with the best team right away and I, the, the way I do these videos, I wake up super early, I make the teams, I get them out to you as soon as possible so you guys can get going. And, um, of course, as the days go, as the hours go, as I use the teams, of course I'm going to switch them up a little bit. Like, mo a lot of the time I'll get it right the first time, but I may tweak it a little bit as I go. And with, the, with this team, I'm feeling like the second Red Charlotte and the weapon are the two things that you can maybe tweak very slightly and make it better. Because if you can get the Red Charlotte to get all of its mana back, like, right away, then you don't need the second one. So you could put something else there, maybe an Empowered Converter, um, like something that changes some color to red. Uh, I know there's one of those, either, like, Scurvy Sea Dog or First Mate Axe Lubber. One of those two will turn a color to red at the start of battle and powered. So maybe you want to use that instead. And then, as far as the weapon goes, like, Skeleton Key, um, Blunder and Peril plunder and peril whatever it's called um the new weapon like let me know in the comments you guys are going to have more time with it you don't have to like record a video as soon as you wake up so you let me know and put it in the comments so other people can see and um what weapon did you come up with i went with bronzelock pistol i'm thinking new weapon skeleton key plunder and peril something like that might be better something that makes gold quicker um but the egg thief is really good because it can summon if you lose the red charlotte um, having two Red Charlottes is good in case you, you lose the first Red Charlotte. But yeah, the second Red Charlotte, the weapon, maybe you can do something better. All right, that is it for today. Uh, like, share, subscribe, consider joining. Helps a lot. Tell your guild about the channel. Comment below. Consider ding dong in the bell. It really helps a lot. You'll get notified as soon as I post a video or go live. Ding dong the bell. Peace.